Ni är låg, komrätt. Not many people know Victor Ross är nuclear scientist. But anyway, back in 1958, Soviet Kremlin asked Victor to conduct great patriotic study for greater good of supreme Soviet. Victor graciously accept, and Victor began study on effect of nuclear radiation on human body. Soviet Kremlin had a big Russian plan to drop bomb on the United States and then send an invasion force to take control of country. Soviet Kremlin wanted to know if it's safe to expose the Russian forces to radiation and aftermath of bomb. Victor head to Siberian Gulag to begin study, and Victor spent eight months there. Now maybe you ask, Victor, what is Gulag? Well, Victor tell you. First, all praise to current Russian president. Victor know that current Russian president, whoever he may be, is best president Russia ever have. Praise be upon him forever. Now, anyway. Every now and then, politician in Russia try to take power away from supreme and unquestioned president. And more often than not, politician fail to get power. Instead, he arrested and sent to horrible place in Siberia called Gulag. Gulag is prison for enemies of Russian president. If you challenge president and fail, you end up in Gulag. And what happened in Gulag? Victor, go to Gulag and promise you freedom in exchange for participation in scientific study. Of course. No one in Gulag ever get freedom. Freedom simply concept Victor used to convince prisoner to help study. But anyway, Victor spent eight months in Siberian Gulag and tell prisoner they get freedom if nuclear radiation not harm them. Unfortunately, nuclear radiation kill every single one of them. So Victor have no choice but to conclude that prisoner in Gulag simply not want freedom enough to live. Soviet Kremlin agreed that Victor had to try different Gulag for better results. In hindsight. Victor should have probably concluded that radiation bad for human body. Not a prisoner in first gulag not want freedom enough. But that not how Soviet science work. Soviet science more practical than American science. So anyway, Victor finally get results Soviet Kremlin want, and Victor hailed as hero of Soviet Union. He was first of many times Victor hailed as hero of Soviet Union. So if you want nuclear bomb in your country, call Victor. Victor, make bomb for you without question.